This video will show you how to use Weave Video to create audio files that you can easily share with your students. You'll go to WeVideo.com and select Login and Login with Google. Once you're logged into Weave Video, you'll select Projects. Create a new folder by clicking Create New Project or you can use an existing folder. I will call this Audio Files and select Personal. Click Next. You can skip this part where it asks you to add media. Click Next and then you'll create video. Select From Scratch Blank Edit and then click Start. Once you're in your timeline, you're ready to record by clicking My Media. Click Narrate and you'll see a microphone on the bottom. You'll click that and it'll give you a three second countdown. Testing, testing, one, two. Click the stop button when you're done and then over to the left. If you're happy with your recording, you'll click the check. You can delete and re-record if you'd like. I'm going to go ahead and click the check and then once you do that, your recording all automatically goes to your timeline. I'm going to scroll down and you'll see voiceover. There's my recording. I can go back up here and do another recording and it'll just keep adding it to another voiceover line. Once you're finished, you just click finish on the top right hand corner. Name your file. Click set and now you're ready to export it. You can rename it again if you'd like. Under export, you'll select audio only. Under destinations, I always like to select Google Drive as well just to have a backup. And then make sure your this is marked as public because you want your link able to be played by anyone. So once you do that, you'll click export and your exports all go into this tab where it says exports. Click that and then you'll see your file, your audio file. You'll double click on that and then you can share this in several different ways. First, you can just click the link either on the top where the URL is or get the link from the share link on the bottom right and copy it. And then you can share it in a Google Doc. You can put it in Google Classroom, Seesaw, email, whatever format you want. You can also select Google Classroom right here on the bottom left and select to share it to any of your classes. That's it. This is how you use WeVideo to create an audio file and easily share it with your students.